What the fu- Hey everyone, this is Gronskis here, and today, um, if you're a United fan, you're most likely to have seen that pile of shit we saw yesterday. Oh my god. I mean, it's yesterday for me, anyway. But yeah, let's, um, just want to say well done to Liverpool. Yeah, absolutely smashed us. But yeah, um, Liverpool, well done, you smashed it. Well done. Uh, props to you. Um, better team on the, on the day, honestly. Um, but let's talk about United. Um, absolutely horrific. Honestly, it was literally a disaster from start to finish. Like, none of them turned up. None of them. I mean, yeah, Ronaldo tried to turn the game around. And Pogba being as useless as ever. I mean, I don't know why people rate him. I, I don't rate him whatsoever. I, I'm sorry, but he is not a good midfielder. Fucking McTominay's burning him. But yeah, what went wrong with United yesterday? I mean, Bruno, he was literally, like, open, like, I think, the third minute. And he absolutely skyrocketed it. I mean, what the hell, honestly? Like, I, d I don't know what to say. Like, after 30 minutes, we were done for. Ugh. And that positioning from the defence, oh my god, what is that about, honestly? Honestly. It's absolute her shit. Absolute shambles of shit, honestly. Honestly, the positioning from Maguire, Luke Shaw, um, Lindelof. Yeah, there was no creativity, like, when we were on the counter-attack. I mean, just nothing whatsoever. I mean, every time Liverpool on the counter-attack, it, like, it, 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 it looked like he was going to end the 8-0. 10-0. You know what? 10-0. That's probably an understatement. Fucking hell. I felt, I felt Liverpool were going easy on us, to be honest. Because they could have scored more. Like, a lot more. I mean, De Gea's positioning was terrible as well. And like, he wasn't good on the one-on-ones. But then again, like, to be honest, one-on-ones are, like, difficult. Like, for even for the best of goalkeepers. I mean, then again, like, some of the goals we conceded was just a rip it. I mean, like I said, his defence didn't help him either. So he's just pulling up with enough shit for years. But to be honest, I don't think it's because... Because it's tactical wise, because we do have world class players, they're just shit when it comes to performing. I swear every season as the United fan, the same thing happens. Like, like we think we're gonna do this, you know. Like, I, I put United to win the league this season, and we got battered 5 0. 5 oh my god. They could have easily, honestly, I kid you not, they could have won 10 0. Now, my thoughts on the Ollie situation. Um, it is not looking good for Ole whatsoever. I wouldn't be surprised if he does get sacked after this game. See, the thing is, say if, say if we do sack him, to be honest, I don't know who should get the United like, job, you know, as manager, because it's a career in like, uh, poison, to be honest. Like, honestly, if you're a manager of Man United, and then you get sacked, that's pretty much your career ending. I don't know if it's because, like, if I'm standing ungrateful because... Of the fact that we've been spoiled that much, you know, from Ferguson. I don't know if it's because, like, because we won that much, that um, that expectations are instant. So what I mean by that is that we expect a trophy, you know, as as soon as possible. When usually it takes a lot of time for a manager. Am I Oli in or Oli out? I just don't know, to be honest. I'm like, yes and no. The problem I have with Oli is that he doesn't have the aggression. At least I don't think, anyway. I don't think he has aggression. You know, I don't think he has, like, the balls to, you know, to go to the players and think, what, yo, what the fuck are you doing? Sort this out. Yeah, I mean, Paul Scholes, he, he said it perfectly after the Atlanta game in the Champions League. Like, um, do what they did against Liverpool and see how they like, do. And he was right with Buddy. We didn't even struggle. We just got annihilated. The thing with Ole is that he goes through a bad spell, and then for some reason United all of a sudden go on such like an impressive run, like towards like the end of the season. If I was to be generous on Ole, um, I'd probably give him until the end of the season. And to be honest, if we don't even make a top four, then I think it is time for him to go. But yeah, those have been my thoughts about Man United at the moment. Um, let me know what you think in the comments down below. And if you're a Liverpool fan, props to you. Honestly, you outplayed us.
But yeah, leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, guys.